few days off work this week for the Thanksgiving holiday, we have just the Make It Monday project for you. If you're noticing your skin's a little dry, we're showing you how to make hydrating lotion bars with all natural ingredients. The winter months are known for cooler weather, which unfortunately dries out your skin. If you know the struggle, then you will love these lotion bars. Jennifer Smith is showing us ways to make our own with a few ingredients, which are all natural and free of toxins. Here's what you'll need. Beeswax pellets, coconut oil, shea butter, essential oils, and silicone molds. Before you get started, start boiling a pot of water about two inches deep. Now get all your ingredients. For the base, you'll want to combine the coconut oil, shea butter, and beeswax pellets. Um, depending on what color you want these to be, you, there are yellow beeswax pellets out there. Um, I like the white. I just think it looks it looks nice. Yeah. Some people like to use soap color in these just okay. to make them a different color. I, I like the natural look because it's a natural product and it kind of gives that illusion. You can make as much or as little as you want as long as they're equal parts. Jennifer chose to do two ounces of beeswax, two ounces of coconut oil, and two ounces of shea butter. I'm going to put the measuring cup in water and just kind of do like a, a double boiler method and we're just going to have to let that boil down. Expect this to take anywhere from five to ten minutes. Give it an occasional stir so it melts easily. While you're waiting, lay out the molds. Jennifer suggests using silicone molds. She found these for just a few dollars on Amazon. When your mixture is fully melted, get your essential oils. I'm going to add some lavender oil and this is frankincense oil. Um, itchy winter skin, I, I kind of think of that. Um, that's a, just a really, these are just really soothing, um, calming oils. Add 10 to 12 drops of each oil and stir. When you're done, all you have to do is pour the mixture slowly into the molds. If you're using silicone trays, it's a good idea to keep a cookie sheet underneath so it's easier to lift up. So I'm going to stick these in the fridge. These will harden in about 30 to 40 minutes. When they're ready, pop them out and use them right on your skin. They absorb quickly on dry skin and don't leave a greasy residue. The beeswax kind of helps hold in that moisture, so much like any kind of salve you get, these lotion bars are great. These are an easy gift idea too. Just add them to a bag and tie a cute ribbon around it. These lotion bars are fairly low cost to make, especially if you use these ingredients for other homemade products as well. So join us at the same time next week as we show you how to make homemade bath bombs with some of the same ingredients. That's your Make It for this Monday. For other Make It ideas any day of the week, follow me on Pinterest by searching Maria WNZT. You can also follow along on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat.